happy day, oh happy day, when Jesus was. Oh, Val Val? Not my Val Val, dang! And she had another, y'all, this is what I'm talking about, Val Val, we do. but it's much better than nothing anyways guys good morning i just got done doing some light work some light cleaning and getting this coffee in my system but i'm about to go ahead and get ready because i have to be leaving the house soon so that i can um, get ready to meet my friend for church so i'm gonna come back and talk to you guys in a minute <laughs> Method where like I wash it and I put braids in, so when I take it out, it's crinkled. But I'm not doing that today. But look how long it is. It stops at like almost halfway down my back. Oh, long hair. Don't care. Yes, ma'am. Okay, let me stop because I'm definitely feeling myself trying to get ready for the good Lord. Like, amen. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. Let me stop. <laughs> Honestly, it does look cute out. Like, should I run my hair out? I'm gonna just do a ponytail. I'm gonna slip my edges back and I'm gonna do a ponytail. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take the edges out. <sighs> Y'all bear with me because I swear I'm not trying to be late to church. I haven't been to church in so long because usually, like, I'm super busy on the weekends, but since my friend invited me and I could use some extra prayers, like why not? So that's what we're gonna do. So I just use this stuff called My Gel. Been using it for years. It's literally like, <laughs> I'm not really like one to get all dressed up every weekend, but since I'm going out with the girly, I figured like why not? You know what I mean? So I feel like the weeks are like always so jam packed, like it's hard to really catch a minute for yourself. So I literally try to focus on like doing fun things on the weekend, like what I like to do for self care. Yeah. And then once I'm done my hair, I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup. All right, y'all. I just decided to do like a regular pony. I literally do my makeup in like 10 minutes. I'm not a professional by any means, but this is how I've been doing it for years. 
in some lip gloss. So I'm about to go ahead and make some breakfast. I swear to God, like, I swear y'all, like this always happens where I try to be somewhere on time and then Woke up early, I don't know. I hope you guys are having an amazing weekend. I just got done making breakfast and eating breakfast. So I'm about to get on the road. I'm meeting with one of my really, really good friends named Valerie. She's a little camera shy, but she said it's okay. But if you're new to the channel, I would love for you to hit the subscribe button. Please hit the bell so that you get notified every time I post, which is usually a few times out of the week. And you don't want to miss it. Finally on the road. I'm finally on the road. <laughs> um it was a crazy morning that's for sure but tell me why the summer weather is summering like when as soon as I stepped out the house I said oh my gosh like I felt my face melting like it was hot like if this is what hot girl summer feel like baby <laughs> Woo. I'm like let me google and see when winter is gonna be here because no way no way are we supposed to be in this humidity like this like at all I was planning to update you guys when I actually got to the church, but circumstances have led me to come on here and tell y'all what John did, the husband did. He went to the gym at four o'clock this morning. I didn't go because I had to get ready to go down to see Valerie. He took the keys off my key. And when I got in the car and I was on my way, almost on the highway, that's like, what, 15 minutes away from the house, he calls me, he tells me he forgot to give me the five. Do y'all know if I would've drove 50 miles down to Delaware and I would've turned the car off? There's no way I would've been able to get the car to turn back on because he had the five. So at this point, we're just gonna be late and we're gonna make it to the service and soak in whatever it is in because W hubs, but what? Just take my entire key the next time. You don't like mine because my key thing got flowers on it, and he always tells me it's too girly. I get it, but this is to prevent circumstances and things like this happening where I'm leaving and you still have the key because we're sharing a car, his car. I just made it to the church. I'm waiting for my friend to come and get me. I'm so mad that I came in here late, late than ever. So, everybody has been asking to meet you. So, y'all, not my Val Val with her church outfit on. No, you gotta say hi to the people. <laughs> we just got back. Hold on. But not <laughs> I'm extra, I'm extra. But yeah, this is Valerie, a little OOTD outfit of the day. She got the nice green jumper suit. Hit him with the heels. The heels, you know it. <laughs> Yo, she be getting us up on these damn steps knowing it's 90, degree, 90 degrees outside. I guess I'm the only one that's tired because I got to pee and I got all this stuff. Oh, we up here? Yeah. Oh. Well, that wasn't too bad. It's just hot. Yeah. <laughs> but tell me why we was at Wawa. We was at Wawa. And I checked out, got my little food or whatever. And I'm like, oh, can I please get a bag? He gonna say, oh, that's gonna be 32 cents. 
not a problem. But why y'all had already checked out? Is he then telling me that the bag is 32 cents? Like I'm just supposed to just carry the stuff, huh? That's that's what we gonna do. It's like what? Why are y'all trying to do that to me? Like what did I do to deserve that? You get what I'm saying? Like Valerie, does that make sense? Like does it even make an ounce of sense? Like why not say, hey man, would you like a bag? It's gonna be 32 cents before I check out. Right. But but did he do that, Val? Uh -oh. No, he didn't do that. But y'all, this is my best friend Val from high school. Hi. Uh, how many years has it been? Been over 12. 12 years. 12? 11, 12. This is my girl Val from high school. Uh, uh, I guess this is random. Favorite high school memory? <laughs> I'm laughing at uh, our laughs. Laughing at remember Mr. Um, Gordon Wright. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Not the old teachers. How do you remember these? My favorite high school memory, but it was my favorite high school memory, is when I used to ask Valerie to help me on a test. And she would cover her paper and say, should have studied Paris. Like, she wasn't trying to help me. Not even a little bit. And I'm like, really, though? You're going to do me like that? Yeah, she definitely did. But we about to eat our food. And then maybe when we leave, she's going to tell y'all about the sight and sound because she invited me to it. And I'm super excited to see the story. Is it Moses, right? Yeah. The story of Moses. So we about to sit down for a little bit and just relax because it's hot outside. and almost passed out like 10 times. No lie. All right, y'all. We just about to leave out and make our way to Philly. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's raining. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it was so humid and it's raining. But I'm not really mad about it because it was so hot and I feel like this is going to kind of help cool everything down. But I got to run to the car and get the charger. So we we'll talk to y'all when we get in the car. Oh, no, girl, you don't got to look at the camera. You can keep looking. <laughs> hey, y'all. So we on our way to Texas Roadhouse. Um, so, of course, I'm going to show y'all what we do get when we get there. It's been about maybe an hour or so driving. So we've just been in here vibing, catching up on old times. So basically... Um showcases bible different bible stories mm -hmm. come to life through um a lot of um characters singing, theater and plot, actions like, like that stage play um lighting so mm -hmm. they bring like um bible stories to life so this year we're seeing moses and we're excited for that yes we're excited about it because i've never been and i'm just like yes like why why not i should i wish i had known about it before but i'm glad that now we're getting the opportunity to see something different and um, just kind of, you know, take it all in. Mm -hmm. So we'll see you guys when we get to Texas Row House. There's this song called Love Lifted Me. Love lifted me. To Jesus. <laughs> so how it go? No. Lifting me up. It goes like um, love lifted me. And I think. Uh, love lifted me. Love lifted me. When nothing else could help. I like your version better. Did me, love lifted me when nothing else could help. Love lifted me. Yeah, it sounds like that. I, I think I'm not gonna sing when you sing because I, I was going down and you was going up and <laughs> let's just not. <laughs> What's my favorite church song? Hmm. My favorite church song is. Do you know Oh Happy Day?
I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> so basically, we was gonna go to Texas Red House, but telling us that it was gonna be like a 45 minute, to, they said it was gonna be a 45 minute to 50 minute wait, and I was like, oh no baby, we can't do that. So there was like an Applebee's, that was like right across the street, so we went over there. Um, what you give your food out of 10? 10. She said it's 10. She said it's 10 out of 10. Like, I feel you on that. I give my food an 8 out of 10. I think it was an 8 out of 10. I think that's fair. Only because I like my pasta, like, I like my pasta sauce to be more thick. I'm only about to make our way to see Sight and Sound. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to record. Do they allow phones in there? Yeah, I'm not allowed to have cameras or... I won't be having any cameras because I don't want to get kicked out. It's only like nine to ten minutes from here. Uh oh. Oh. Val, Val? Not my Val, Val. Dang. <laughs> and then she had a nerd. Y'all, this is what I'm talking about. Val, Val, we doing this? She be turning around laughing. Like, not are you okay, friend, but just laughing. Like, this is pure. Are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? I didn't mean you supposed to say hey are you okay friend and then that but she go and burst out <laughs> laughing didn't even care about is my chin okay like you could have broke my chin it's like nah I'm joking it's, it's okay she she just uh, a little heavy on the foot if your mom's no was that a speed bump wasn't it it was like a little speed bump thing but yeah we about to make our way to this little sighting sound Valley got her long hair flowing out <laughs> Let me stop talking to you because you we, we don't need no more mistakes now. Nah. We don't need no more mistakes. <laughs> Is that you looking at the car making sure they don't hit you? Ooh, it do feel like they're gonna hit us though. Okay, she's like, y'all better not hit my car because oh girl, move over. This bus is turning. Let's move on over. This bus is turning. Like, yeah, girl, we might as well just go at this point. <laughs> No, nah, like, nah, nah. You pulled out quick, fast, and her, she said, you about to hit my car. Like, what? But, girl, no. Two lanes to turn left. But not Val Val looking like a model. Like, what? Y'all, she dressed, she be dressing up. Like, I can't even do the heel thing. Y'all can't see it, but she got on heels. And I'm walking on my flats, like, how do you do that? Like, <laughs> What's the secret, Val? Because I, I need to know. Like, as soon as I put them on, my feet start hurting. It ain't even a second that passes. It's just they just start hurting. Like, help me, please. Help me, please. How do you do it? Every time I see her, she got on heels. It's like, go off with it. Like, you must be an aspiring model, and I just didn't know it, right? Is that what it is? I've been told that you... You should be a model, like... Go, she be having the shoulders out like tell them to hit you up <laughs> where can they hit you up at though because if i get comments asking like can you model for them like what, what am i supposed to tell them you're gonna say you have to show me the coin that's what you're gonna have to say right <laughs> let me hear show me the coin <laughs> show me the money show me the coin <laughs> We be needing the, the shmoney, honey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like, nah, but y'all, let's focus on the road so we can get there safe and sound. And um, I'm going to come back on and tell y'all our experience with seeing Moses. Mm -hmm. So, we'll see y'all later. Can you imagine doing that for hours? <laughs>
just left the show. I was able to get a little bit of footage at the end because they really had the security people like trying to kick people out or like give them warning signs. But it was super, super good. And um, you guys will just have to see it in person because I don't really think the video footage that I got really does it justice right now. Right. And <laughs> um, so you, what'd you say your favorite part was? So I like the I like the Red Sea part. How they made it like very they cooled down the room. It was very mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. it was almost like you were in a scene. And right, I right. I agree. The Passover scene was good too. Yeah, there was just a lot of good lot scenes. Of scenes. It's hard to really pick apart, but I will say that it was very lively. A lot of musical aspects and elements. I feel like they really did good with bringing like the story to life. But that is really the end of this video. We thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and we'll see you in the next one. And thank you, Valerie, for joining us. Thank you for the great opportunity and for letting me know about the show. And like okay. I said, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. The next one that I'll be doing with Val. Because um, I know you guys have asked me about her. Like, <laughs> y'all asked me about Val Val when she's here. So we'll be seeing y'all for her when it's her birthday. And definitely got something special planned for that. So, yeah, we'll see you then. Deuces. See ya.